Hey, what's up guys? How's it going? Today we're going to go over how to draw Thor. We're going to do basically a headshot of him. I'm going to start... Uh, oh, I'm going to be using a number two pencil. And I am going to be using uh, just a regular ballpoint pen. But uh, if you want to know which one I'm using, it's Zebra F308. That would be the ballpoint pen I'm using. So... I drew kind of an oval there to kind of get the uh, general head shape down. You gotta draw a line for his eyes, a line under his nose, a line on the bottom of his mouth, and the line for the kind of the uh, top of the head area, the hairline. Uh, you can divide these into thirds the hairline, the eyes, and the nose. Draw a straight line down. I'm going to draw a shape, like a triangle shape to kind of represent the eye socket. It's going to be in three quarters. I'm going to draw a triangle shape to represent the nose. I'm going to draw the chin, it's going to be a very square, superhero esque chin, even though he's got that goatee thing going on. Cheekbone, the zygomatic arch. Draw the wings on his helmet. I'm gonna draw his helmet kind of coming down. We draw more of a cartoon in the cartoon helmet rather than the movie. Prong sticking out of his helmet, and then we're gonna draw the other side of the uh, the wings there. Yeah, they're coming out the other side of the helmet. Hopefully, hopefully you can see that. Let me move this around. All right. So that's him. Got long hair coming out the side there. Flowing long hair. So that's a good uh, general uh, placement with a pencil. I'm going to put the pencil away and take out the pen. And I'm going to go right into where his eyeball is. Let's see. Go into the eye. Go into the eyelid. Pupil. Under the eye, the eye on the lower part of the eyelid. Um, let's go to the bridge of the nose there briefly, but I went back here to the uh, the bag of the eye there. Putting a little bit like his eyebrows there underneath his helmet. Going back to the nose. Running the shape of the nose. Wing of the nostril. Going to the other side, finding the eye over there. Uh, 
kind of the iris and pupil there. Same thing, finding the eyebrow underneath, and then like a darker shape. Putting in kind of a shadow there, it's hard to distinguish between what is shadow and what is hair of his eye, eye, eyebrow. Going real quick to the underside of the nose is going to have, uh, you know, because the light's coming from above, going downward, it's going to cast, uh, the nose is going to cast a shape onto its uh, mouth. Going back over here. Back, back into the eye of the other side. Putting in the shadow pattern from the helmet, casting down onto the nose. All right, I'm gonna go into that goatee. So we go into the mouth. Drawing the lower side of his goatee over his mouth there. His beard. Drawing the lower lip. Shadow onto the lower lip. Going back to the outside of the goatee. I'm gonna make his goatee a little cleaner. I don't know if this is Thor from the comic. Not the movie. Drawing the spaces there where the skin sticks out. The goatee that has a pattern of hair here. Draw on the upper side of his helmet. Draw on something uh, designed protruding from his helmet. That I had to put there. Drawing the wing. I'm gonna do this other wing over here. Other wing. I'm gonna go with the rest of his beard or rest of his goatee beard thing. Wing pattern. Wing pattern are kind of like butter knives.
draw his neck over here, which I didn't really go over before with pencil, but I'm going to draw his neck. Draw his hair coming from behind the wing pattern there, his hair is indicated. Hair coming from behind him over there as well. At this moment, I'm gonna kind of erase a lot of the pencil lines so they don't get in the way. I'm trying to analyze certain things, and the pencil lines are really just in the way. So, I'm going to put in some shadow patterns from his helmet, uh, probably B1, from his wing there, I would imagine. So at this point, I'm going to kind of just play around with him as a character. I'm going to put in things that maybe I think are nice uh, design-wise and they might not go with the character, so don't uh, freak out. But first thing I notice is his helmet. I want to put stuff on it. I want to make it a different... Uh... I'm going to go on and be very careful with the lines that I pull. Because I'm using pen, so you don't really know how could affect it. Putting more of a design pattern on his helmet. Mm -hmm. 